This is AntiTube, and it's October of 2020, and that's mean that means it's been uh, five years now since I started my channel with some very poorly done videos <laughs> using a $99 camera and one desk lamp. <laughs> uh, I had been doing restoration for a few years before that, and. Uh, as a method of pain control because I had found that concentrating on the machines and working on them, trying to figure them out and so forth, uh, just helped me get uh, through the day with a lot fewer pain meds. Now, uh, back then there was a lot less information um, about some of the machines. Um, I kind of found that frustrating, but I mean, sure, there, there was information about the 1591 and the 201-2 and, you know, the 301 was such a popular machine for so long and the Slantomatics, Rocketeers, and uh, I mean, even, even back then, people were getting rich from selling featherweights, you know, <laughs> they were they were so hugely uh, popular and, and expensive. Hmm. But uh, there wasn't much information about some of the models I liked. Like the, the, the blue machines, like the 337, 338, uh, with the bell crank hook systems. And the 347 and 348, those beautiful uh, kind of robin's egg blue machines. And, and 457s, the 513 type models, and, and the Genie, you know, models that, that came with their own slip-on covers and stuff. But I, I slowly learned information about them and learned where I could find it and just kept working on them. And uh, that's why I had put up a, a couple videos that first time. And I, I was stunned when I went back a couple weeks after my first video and saw that 20 people had actually viewed it. I was, I was like, wow, <laughs> that was amazing to me. <laughs> and as I did more videos, uh, more people seemed to be more interested in them. And, and in general, the people were more interested, I think, in fixing their own machines and uh, especially... Uh, you know, a couple generations younger than me were interested in sewing and finding out that, uh, you know, a, an old vintage singer was affordable and that they, they could work on it and they could get it to sew because their grandma or an aunt or a mom told them, you know, don't buy that plastic stuff, go, go find an old singer or an old machine, you know, a metal one. And uh, that was so encouraging to, to have these younger people, you know, I, I, my grandma gave me her machine, I'm trying to learn how to use it, and how do I do this, and how come this won't work? And so I just kept making more and more videos, and uh, trying to make them better and more interesting, and I've always tried to do a lot of detail on, on my videos, and uh, the... I ended up, you know, I'm at this point where I have like over 550 videos. <laughs> and uh, it, it kind of amazed me that I got that, that number because that's a couple videos a week average for five years. But uh, I've had almost two and a half million views. And, and the views from just about every country and territory on the planet. So... Uh, it, it's kept me going, and it's been uh, very rewarding and interesting for me. I, I never monetized my channel with commercials and stuff because I, I found commercials annoying. But also, it, to me, it was kind of like a, a gift that I had a skill or talent that I could work on these machines, you know. And I, I just felt like making money off of it didn't, didn't seem 
the way to go. <laughs> so I may regret that someday, <laughs> but right now I'm, I'm, I'm happy with that decision. Um, now I've received donations from people over the years to my PayPal account. And, and that helps so much, and I, I was really honored by that when people do that. Um, and it's helped me buy better cameras and better lighting and uh, better tools, <laughs> you know, more tools and and uh, used machines and parts to fix them up and things like that. So I, I'm happy and honored by those donations. The people you you were very kind and generous to do that. Um, I, I want to give you all a heads up to my subscribers and, and to all viewers of my channel too that I'm going to be taking a break uh, from my channel for a while. Uh, it's time consuming to record and edit and upload the videos and to answer so many uh, emails and, and questions and stuff every day. And I, at this time, I need to take care of some business. And I have to get some affairs in order uh, now. So uh, I'm just stepping away for, for a time. Uh, depending on how that goes and what happens along the way, I may be able to respond to some emails during that time, but, but I'm not even sure of that. We'll see what happens. So you won't be seeing new videos on my channel, at least for some time, and I wanted, I wanted you all to know about that. Now, uh, please remember, I have those 500 plus videos on my playlist page, and, and there, you know, the playlist will have a model number, or it'll be about a, a motor, or a type of foot controller, or, a, you know, a buttonhole, or something like that. So in the description below this video, I can put a link to that playlist page. So if you want to click on that and go there, and if you want to bookmark it if you want, so that you, you know, can find your way back there and scroll through the playlists and stuff, or the videos, and see something you're interested in. Um, if you've never... Uh, restored a machine I would really encourage you to do it uh, you can pick up some of those uh, machines on that page for 25 bucks uh, you know at Goodwill and um, garage sales and and uh, people have found them <laughs> on the side of the road and and everything you know so uh, just just pick one up and watch the videos and and give it a go. Do do as much as you're comfortable with, but you I think you'll find it real rewarding. And uh, you know if you get a machine running and the, it, it's success. And even if you don't sew, I mean I have plenty of viewers that get the machines and fix them up and everything, and then give them to a charity. So you could do that. And w with this pandemic right now, you know a lot of us are stuck at home a lot more than we're used to so you know it might be something that you enjoy instead of uh, video games or TV or Netflix or staring at whoever you're living with you know <laughs> lock yourself in a room and tear apart a sewing machine you know <laughs> so uh, thank you to all my subscribers who watched my channel and encouraged me in my endeavors um, to help people with their machines. I, I'm really honored by your viewership. And thanks to all of you who shared in the comment sections with great questions and pointing things out and, and uh, making such great comments. And I, I enjoyed those and I enjoyed a lot when, when people shared and pointed things out. So, I, I guess that's it. Um, I, I, uh, just will say to, to everybody thanks so much for watching my channel and uh, best of luck to you and please take care